Hello everyone, my name is Keanu and what I got for you today is the best Zerg player in the world facing off against one of the best Protoss. We are going to see together 4 amazing games of top level Starcraft 2. We are in game number 1, we are going to find ourselves on the map Stargazer. Now spotting here we have none other than Serral from Finland and in the opposite corner we have Showtime, one of your favorite from Germany. These are two extremely good players and we are probably going to see amazing games. Now let's see what is going to happen in the first game. So far start down opening and hopefully a little bit of cheese. We already see here a hatcher in the proximity of the Protoss base with something we do not usually see. It's meant to produce uh, more uh, attack units in the proximity. Probably we are going to see a rush. You see it's very very close to each other. This is not the style of Serral, but Serral likes to spice it up sometimes. Here we have the probe. Seeing when something is off, like where is the second base? The hatchet should be by now ready. Already something is fishy. Let's see from several point of view, and uh, now you see has no idea. Showtime is in total darkness. Here is several point of view, here is showtime. But luckily for us, we can see everything. So what is going to happen? I have no idea, as usually we are going to look for it together. Showtime feels uh, extremely comfortable. His playstyle is to do macro and uh, everybody knows that Serral is the best of the best that there can be. If you go on uh, the Wikipedia page, there are so many awesome uh, info about him and this is something new. He's actually going to make sure to use the back door. So what the drones are doing are literally opening the door for Zerg units to go behind his opponent back. So yes, here we have a nice wall off. Uh, for sure uh, Showtime is thinking like this safe uh, area is going to protect him against any uh, Zerg units and now it's a little bit too late. This Adept is going to spot what is going on and now it's like oh oh moment. What uh, Showtime is going to do? Now he's uh, starting a Stargate. We have just another Adept coming, but the Zerg Swarm is on its way. Already we have Zerglings going. Uh, the difference in army is too much. Like we have 19 for Serral, only 9 for Showtime. So Serral surprising us with a quick attack directing his opponent base. These adepts cannot face so many zerglings. And if this pylon goes down, everything going down. So the zerglings are going back to the safety of the queens. This oracle is easily destroyed by two queens. The creep is spreading into the base of Showtime. This is something unexpected. Now again the Zerlings are attacking, this pylon is essential, if Serral is able to kill both of them, then Showtime has zero chances of survival. Now another oracle, but here is the big problem, we are going to see Bailings morphing inside the base. This is something awesome, I never saw it. This is an extremely good uh, rush and Serral is the winner. Showtime realized he has zero chances. Stay tuned for game number two. Thank you for watching.